the triple C. I'm gonna make them bend the knee. Rolling with the triple C. Don't really got the heat. All right, guys, since a lot of you guys like to troll the triple C, since I like to do a lot of trolling, guess what, guys? Now you guys can have at it at me. So again, guys, I'm going over all the trolling. I'm going all over all kinds of tweets. And I'm gonna see if I have any type of comebacks for you suckers. Let's go, bring it on. So here we have it. So our first tweet. Bro, I'm so tired of Henry Cejudo. Bro, make it end. <laughs> Dude, we're just getting started, whoever the hell you are. This is PJZ pressure. Marab about to send the old man back to retirement. I don't know about all that. I think I think we're just getting started. Next, Henry Cejudo, you a little version of the one you hating on. <laughs> you need to get off social media and start focusing on Marab. He about to retire you. I don't think so, ladies and gentlemen. I'm about to retire him. I'm, I'm about to retire Al Jermaine Sterling's butt plug. <laughs> Okay, let's go. We got we got one from MMA B Mama 80. You will never beat Marab. Never, no matter how hard you try, your time at the top is over, Henry. Your takes on MMA are wrong. So do something. So do something else, not MMA. Please. Nobody likes you. Hey, Ali, easy money. <laughs> I tell you what, I think this guy, whatever the hell his name is, I think he might be from freaking, from Kazakhstan, because he sounds like damn Borat. But no, it is gonna be easy, easy money on February 17th. And his name is not Marab, it's Marat. Okay, from North Paul MMA. Glad to see you put a shirt on after being bullied for being fat as fuck a few days ago. <laughs> Hey, it's all part of the process, dude. You know, without, you know, you, you gotta enjoy life. Enjoy life, North Paul MMA. You just gotta, you just gotta enjoy, dude. You know what, Triple C? When, when you accomplish everything, when you become the Olympic champ, the flyweight champ, and the bantamweight champion of the world, you can do whatever the fuck you want. So you can do me a favor, and you can bend a knee too. I'm surprised, I'm surprised nobody has talked about my, the, you know, the little piece of my uh, hair, unless it's in here. <laughs> Karate kicking door. Look at this. <laughs> Fun times AL underscore AL. Cejudo, Cejudo hates that we will never be liked or loved as much as Moreno. First of all, all you casuals, all you backstabbing casuals, you guys are all a bunch of bandwagon fans. So this is the same reason why, you know what I say to all you fans? You guys are either with me or you're against me. There's one thing that I do more than anybody. I tell the damn truth. So fuck you and Moreno. Okay, this is from, uh, this is from Kelly, uh, Kelly La MMA. Brand new to fight Cejudo. Brandon needs to fight Cejudo, bro. What is what is this training figgy? Now Albazi, I guarantee he gonna train Pantoja or Roval if they fight Moreno, even Cape or Kai. <laughs> I tell you what, guys, my door is always open. If Brandon Moreno's gonna fight any of these guys, and this is the same reason why they come. We helped Figgy beat him. He didn't come uh, the second time around to fight him. What happened? He ended up losing. Amir Albazi is back in town. He wants to fight Brandon Moreno. I never called him. These guys approached me. You know, you casuals may think I'm just somebody super redundant, but guess what, guys? Numbers don't lie. And guess what? McLovin is about to bend the knee too. Okay, Henry, quit yapping. Your wash, your wash, precious. Why don't you zip up Sugar's fly when you're done using his face for inst insta gains? You're old. Respond back to this, I dare you. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm trying to, okay, okay, I'm old. You know, I'm, you know, if there's anybody that's like a freaking bathroom stall, his name is Sean O'Malley. That actually looks like a damn bathroom stall. I may be old, but I don't look like a freaking public restroom like that, sucker. Like that trans Barbie. Okay, Tim Welch, LOL brother, still mad about what happened with your ex. I didn't even know she was dating you at the time and she never told me that. Again, I'm sorry. <laughs> T 
Tim Welch. This dude, he seems like he seems like he could be a guy like cooks like like he like he's a guy that cooks freaking cookies like in the you know somewhere in the prairie somewhere in Iowa. But anyways, I, I don't know. I, I I think he might be in love with my ice. Go ahead, get at it, dude. But I will say this, Tim Welch, I hit it first. So that's it. That's it, guys. I got all these different tweets. I got all these different things. And guess what, guys? I'm not like Sean Strickland. I can give it and I can take it. So if you don't have haters, you don't have fans. So remember, you're truly the one and only, the greatest combat athlete of all time, King Triple C. And this video was brought to you by the one and only Jimmy Bars. Guys, you guys make sure to start off the week on fire. And that's right. So you guys make sure to go to your local Walmart and get your damn Jimmy bars. Whether you, like, whether you guys like cookies and cream, whether you guys like citrus burst, it is all good. You know why? Because it's a gluten-free bar. So make sure to go to your local Walmart and get your damn Jimmy on. I'm out!